Well, we're already in South Texas and we're headed south of San Antonio into Dimmick County to our field. It's called Big Wells, which is close to the little Texas town of Big Wells, Texas. It's a 3,700 acre lease and it's a field that we're going, it's an old field that we're going to redevelop with uh, some new technologies. Uh, horizontal well drilling development instead of the vertical wells that the field was originally developed on. So we're in beautiful South Texas, uh, thick, thick underbrush, lots of wildlife, and it's green down here, uh, kind of typical of your, your near border town uh, fields and properties in Texas as we're approaching the border of Mexico. This this uh, 3,600 plus or minus acres has has had 32 pre-existing wells on it. It's a mature, primary, primarily produced field. We're looking uh, at doubling its cumulative production. It had produced around six million barrels, just a little under six million barrels. And we're expecting to get that much out of secondary recovery. So we're re-drilling, redeveloping the field. Instead of 32 vertical wells, we're going to be developing this with 16 horizontal wells. Uh, half of those wells will be producers and they'll be offset. You'll alternate between producer, injector, producer, injector. Yeah, this well has uh, been quite an adventure. It's the classic oil field. We've had um, the worst of luck and we've had the best of luck, all, all rolled up into one. Got hit by Harvey, the hurricane and its aftermath, the torrential, torrential rains, flooding location, and we still battled through it and got the well drilled in one to two extra days out of 10 days. We projected 10 days and got it done in 12. So great opportunity for cost to go up and manage to control it. We had a fishing job, but uh, hit it out of the park with our first attempt and even fished it out ourselves before the fishing company got here, which was incredible, incredible luck. But we thought, well, we'll give it a try and it worked. We expect to double the field's production and, and reduce the cost of, of per barrel of, of at all. It's been uh, a question about applying new sciences to old, old fields, old production. A lot of it has been artwork, a lot of it has been good applied uh, technical insights and understandings. And it, is, it is coming together. This is our first well. This is our maiden voyage on this project. And we just put this well on production and it's performing beyond our expectations. So very encouraging as far as the next 15 wells that we have to drill. My name is Matt Barrett. I'm the assembly and uh, service supervisor for Ray's production. And we've just completed our first install of our uh, high angle reciprocating pump. And this pump is different because it could be landed at 90 degrees and actually above. We're excited about this because this is the first install we've done in, in Texas. And we have several installations up in Canada right now with great success. We hope to continue that down here.